hello friends welcome back thank you for your support today's video is uh, preparing semolina with hyacinth beans it's a uh, seasonal beans we get it during the season time especially in karnataka so right now i'm using this beans with the semolina to prepare the breakfast name called upma let's begin the recipe by frying 2 cups of rava in the pan add a tablespoon of ghee to fry the semolina or rava so which adds more fragrance for the semolina upma once it is fried keep it aside now let's go for a next step of cooking add oil mustard seed allow mustard seed to splutter then you can add urad dal chana dal curry leaf green chilli onion turmeric fry it for 1 minute after 1 minute of frying you can add tomato adding tomato for upma recipe is optional but here i'm adding tomato it gives more taste for the upma now let's add beans fry these bean seeds in the oil for 1 minute in a medium flame so after frying of 1 minute you can add water 4 cups of water then salt as per the taste some fresh coriander leaf mix very well close the lid let it cook mix very well close the lid cook it for 10 minutes or until the beans are cooked enough you can use the high flame after 10 minutes of cooking you can check it the beans are cooked enough so it is a time to add semolina or rava add semolina little by little keep mixing it make sure that there is no lumps in it once it is mixed without lumps so let it steam it in a very low flame for another 5 minutes so let it cook in a very low flame for 5 minutes after 5 minutes we can check the semolina breakfast or upma meanwhile let's check out today's motivation when you run alone it is called race when god runs with you it is called grace I hope you will like this motivation friends finally after 5 minutes of cooking you can see the upma or semolina with the beans are really cooked nice so one of the best breakfast recipe you must try once if you like it don't forget to subscribe the channel share the recipe with your friends and family members thank you see you again in the next video bye bye